Do you know what quinoa is? You should. One California entrepreneur is using the edible seed to help two countries. And there's a growing number of gluten-free products on grocery store shelves these days, but how many can claim to be good for your health and good for nearly 300 Bolivian families? Andy and Dream is a line of gluten-free cookies, pastas, and soups made with royal quinoa. Quinoa is a seed. It's farmed and harvested in the Bolivian Andes for the Andy and Dream Company. The dream part of the title could well describe the efforts of the company's founder, the wife of a career diplomat for Bolivia. She saw the poverty of the country while at the same time learning the benefits of the native food quinoa and joining me now is Ingrid Lascano the founder of Andean Dream thank you for joining us thank you and so when your husband was the consul general here for Bolivia you went back and forth to Bolivia that's correct what is it that you saw that inspired you to to create this line? Well, I saw a need particularly interested in quinoa, and I wanted to create a product that would somehow trickle down and impact the lives of the people socially there, because the quinoa farmers were living well below the poverty line. So by creating this product, it has created opportunities in Bolivia, not only for the farmers, but for the people who actually manufacture the products for us. So you have uh, farmers who grow and harvest the quinoa. Yes. Then it goes down what down into the village area it's actually processed there and then once it's processed it's ground into a flour and then once it's ground into a flour we make we make the different products we have cookies we have pasta we have a new line of soups that we're introducing we were showing a couple of photos there because you had given me a photo of what the village looked like before that got right. involved that's right and it was pretty primitive that's correct. There were mud and brick houses without electricity, mud floors, and now you can see the housing is improved. There are solar panels. The kids are going back to school instead of working in the fields. It's created a wonderful opportunity for the people there. The company is how old now? Uh, we're going into our sixth year. And we, we had our start in 2006. We were launched in Whole Foods Market. They gave us our first opportunity, and it's kind of snowballed from there. How do you think the lives of the Bolivian farmers and workers have changed? You mentioned the housing, but what else? Tremendous amount of opportunity for health care. Uh, the housing is improved. The lifestyle in general, as I mentioned, kids are going to school now, having a good education. The wives are, are working with the husbands in family businesses, and just in general a better economy. So let's talk about the line. It wasn't that easy, I would imagine, to create a line of products that were gluten-free, also uh, allergy sensitive or you know, that's right we don't have any dairy products or eggs or soy or corn or nuts they're vegan and our company is fair trade as well so uh, it, it was it was not easy quinoa is a very difficult grain to work with and so it took a while you know to get the recipe down and so we finally mastered that and it, it, we've got a nice pasta with an excellent texture it's been written up in the New York Times it cooks al dente unlike a lot of other gluten-free pastas and also you have cookies we have cookies we have five flavors of cookies um, all of them are gluten-free they're individually wrapped they're vegan um, they they don't have any dairy products soy corn or nuts as I mentioned and all of our packaging is recyclable we have these little individual wrappers and so all of this can be recycled so my goodness you actually um gave birth to this company, so to speak, with an eye towards a lot of different social issues. Yes. You were thinking environment, you were thinking raising the, the uh, economic status of people in Bolivia. That's correct. And at the same time, you've created this wonderful delicious product for those who are sensitive to gluten. That's right, right. We're trying to create a, a healthy alternative snack for people and a healthy alternative meal solution. Now we have the soup as well that we're introducing. Yeah, that's a new product that I haven't heard of. Yes, that's right. Mostly you can find your products in Whole Foods. Whole Foods in all over the country and then we have uh, lots of independents as well. All right, very good. Ingrid Lascano, thank you so much for thank joining you. us. Thank you. Thank you very Congratulations much. Congratulations on this line. Thank you so I'm much. I'm sure there are a lot of people who are sensitive to gluten who are very, very pleased. Thank you. Thank you very much.